What's going on guys? My name is Doug. Welcome to the channel. If you're new, welcome back. If you're not new, I'm not going to waste any of your time with an introduction. I'm really excited to be back. I'm really excited to be making this video for you guys. I'm glad you're all here. A lot of you guys have been talking about this new Skizzy Marsh project he dropped with Pre-Low called I Can't Take Me Anywhere. And that's what we're going to be listening to today. It's got nine tracks. I'm expecting it to be fun. I'm expecting it to be enjoyable. Skizzy Mars, I discovered his music last year. And he was one of my favorite musical discoveries because, you know, all of his projects that I listened to, and, and you can watch the other reactions, they're all on my channel, I think I've got three or four other Skizzy Mars videos, but his music just is so uplifting and it always picked me up and even if I was in a bad mood while I was recording it, it always managed to make me feel so good by the end of the video, you know, so he's got a really unique style, he's got this really happy sound and I'm just excited to be listening to him again. Uh, so we're gonna get right into it. Track one is Wake Up, and uh, yeah, this is I Can't Take Me Anywhere by Skizzy Mars and Prelo. Let's get it. Oh, I like that chord. I'm digging this like uh, very early Kanye-esque drum pattern, you know, this, this really simple a very old school hip hop beat paired with this that really cool wavy guitar you know it sounds like it's supposed to be a rock song by the way he's singing it with the guitar but the drums are so hip hop i think it sounds really cool to hear that together the synth brass sounds so sick yeah I'm liking this vibe, man. This vibe's really cool to this track. One thing I will say is that I wish the vocals were a little louder because right now it feels like the guitars are above the vocals and kind of muffling them out a little bit. Maybe on headphones it'll sound a little clearer and a little louder, but right now the vocals are sounding a little muffled by the guitars, but that's really it. The synth brass really makes this sound so cool, man. Yeah, I take it slow, I never rush. It's crazy how them downers had us fill it up. You call a car, you never walk. And you always smoking on my butt. What's the <laughs> Let's talk about the shit that happened last night. You still asleep, so I tap your shoulder light. Like uh, yeah, you know, it's really smooth, it's really chill. Uh, it's got a really cool vibe, you know, it's, it's, it's a fun track, you can play it at a party, the drums, like I said, they sound so hip-hop, paired with that rock-styled guitar with the, the actual performance from pre-low on the hook, it makes for a really interesting combination. The chord progression on the guitar sounds really cool, and really the track is just about having fun, getting really faded at a party, and waking up the next day, like, we've got to go over what happened last night because I don't really remember it, I've got to see what I remember, what you remember, and like, pair it together to find out what we did last night because you know we had a, a really fun time and kind of lost track of what was going on so it's a cool song i like it i like the vibe to it track two is come a little closer you know i'm liking the distortion on the drums it adds like a, a note to the snare you know and, it, and it, it's in key and it adds another element to the melody or to the you know the keys on this track uh, Skizzy Mars, his voice has always been one of my favorite things about his performance is just the way his voice sounds. Uh, it's just got a really cool sound to it. It sounds really nice to listen to. I love the vibe. I already really like this emotion on this track, this, this feeling that this track is giving off with the guitars and the drums. It sounds really cool. I'm liking this feature, dude. This voice sounds really cool. This is fun. Yo, this is a really fun vibe. It's got this like summer feel to it, you know, riding around with the windows down, blasting this. It sounds really cool. It sounds really enjoyable to listen to. I mean, it really brings out positive emotions, positive vibes. That's the entire 
atmosphere that this track is providing. Uh, I like how smooth their deliveries are, I like the performances, I like the verses. It's not extremely long, so yeah, it's just a really fun, enjoyable track. I enjoyed it. Uh, next is Like Me More. <clears throat> I thought I heard you say you like me more Than all the mother niggas in New York Death punk in your speakers Now you listening to bleachers I'm so long my meat bill Dev Hans and your beast pill Can't comprehend across the line the bass line's so sick, the guitar's so wavy. But now it's back to drama, forever. And they say that we look good together. I'm loving the hi hat rolls. Percussion sounds dope, too. It's a quick track, it's got an awesome vibe to it, it feels really nice, uh, it feels warm and fuzzy, it's got a really cool like R&B-ish vibe to it, I love the performances, I think the guitars are awesome, the bass line's super wavy, the percussion sounds great, I mean I mentioned most of this during the actual song, but it's a cool song. Next is Are You Okay, which is also the name of Skizzy Mars' last project, just a little coincidence I guess. I love their use of guitars on this man. That's been a theme so far, like that's been a motif is the guitar, the awesome guitar riffs. Are you okay? Are you want to be Broadway? Now you're more of a side street. Cool metaphor. And now all of you, I just put up to your crib, hard on my sleeve. Man, that night was crazy, type of shit I couldn't make up. Can you look ravish and darling? Get them in the indignation and your mood swings, your mood swings, they drive me crazy. You don't really mean what you were saying. I oh, I love it. You I know that you getting tired of my games and you ready for the stage. Why well, finally grow the fuck up? And you're like, mm, I love his flow. You were high in ambitions. I only heard you, I didn't listen. I love how relatable he is. I know this isn't what you envision. Are you good? Are you mad? It's hard to tell. You got what I need. Mm. All that shit I said, I don't really mean. No nice. That's the only time I see you now. I see me in everyone else So when I see you Cause I can't I love this breakdown at the end, man you know, they're real creative. I love the performances, man. That's one thing that's been sticking out to me a lot is the performances, their delivery. You know, they always bring a lot of energy. They always bring a lot of emotion. Uh, they're able to convey what they're feeling through their verses and through their parts in the track. So that's been really impressive to me. But for the most part, I mean, all these tracks have just been really awesome, really wavy. They've got cool vibes to them. Really cool songs to just have fun to, to put in the background while you drive around. It's really just feel-good music. So... I like it. Next is Tell Her Friends. I don't really like this arpeggio with the uh, the keys, with the lead. It, it's too chaotic for me already. Like, it's distracting from the from what Skizzy is saying. Yeah, it's too much going on. Yeah, man, that's probably my least favorite so far. That arpeggio, it just it kind of kills it for me, you know, because it just makes it so distracting from what's actually being said, and it really just becomes the main uh, thing in the song for me, you know? It's too chaotic. It feels like there's too much going on at the same time. I just wish it were regular chords, you know? Not broken up like that, but that's okay. Who Ruined Your Night, track six. Home is on fire. I think you were looking for love. This sounds much and better. Later we were opening tabs. An hour later, we were ordering drugs. And you looked like a movie star. Cigarette breaks during a party. I don't really smoke, but it's better than talking. Couple more jokes, couple more laughs. Couple more smokes, couple more drags. It's got a really mellow vibe, man. It's dope. Promise, and I always 
Yeah, this is probably one of the more mellow tracks on this project, but it's got a really cool vibe to it. I enjoyed that one much more than the last track for sure, but I think it's a cool track. It's just, it's nice, you know? It's a nice track. It's not bad music. Track 7. <laughs> It is what it is, we were just kids You said go handle your business I hit the road, used to you I'm asking forgiveness I'm trying to practice persistence Cause to be honest, I miss this I like that this has got more of a little bit of a trap feel where they half-timed it, you know? The snare is on every third beat instead of on every two and four. I like that it's got that vibe to it. I met a girl but she ain't see the vision I tried to call you but you wouldn't pick up It's 2 a.m. I hit you up I wanna talk, you not trying to listen For a week away, yeah look so pretty on your Instagram I wanna let you know that I missed the chance Where long did we switch the plan? Or did we I made a toast? I tried to hit your line but you crazy ghost Wow. This is nice. It's another really cool track. It's wavy and smooth. Tell me where I feel. But we go way back. Guess it kind of makes sense. Those feelings came and they went. Time will tell what they meant. But we go way back. Yeah, it's just another really nice track. They're sticking to what they've been doing for this entire project, which is just mellow vibes, fun tracks, feel good music. Make it smooth, make it wavy, that's it. You know, they, they, they got like a template and they're just redoing it over and over again. Um, so yeah, it's nothing too special, but it's also not bad music. Uh, talk is cheap. track I, I can't get mad at it it's, it's dope you know and they're keeping the tracks relatively short too which is cool let's just head on to the last track I'm not liking this beat too much it's kind of weird Yeah, I don't like that track. That beard was really weird. It didn't feel like there was a really... It didn't feel like there was a melody. It just felt like it was really weird drums. Uh, I didn't really like their performances or their verses. That track could have just been thrown out to me. But this project, um, there's not really too much to say. I mean, it's nine tracks. For the most part, they're just really wavy. They're a lot of fun to listen to. They're great to vibe to. You can play this really quick project in the car if you're driving around should have a blast listening to it with your friends it's got a couple catchy hooks you'll be able to sing it's just a fun listen you know it's not gonna waste you're not gonna be wasting your time if you give this a listen so if you have not listened to this check this out uh, a couple of you guys asked me to start rating these albums so uh, I guess this is gonna be the first album that I really give a number out of 10 um, I, I would give this a solid I'd give this like a seven and a half you know it's nothing too amazing but it's it's above average so yeah seven and a half out of ten it's not bad it's definitely a, a worthwhile listen so like I said if you haven't checked it out go check it out let me know if you think I should continue giving these actual number ratings if that would help you guys determine how how much I like the project or not thank you all for watching follow me on my social media I'll be back soon with another video for you guys just be sure to keep checking out the next videos that are coming out got a lot of good content coming up for you guys so I'm keeping an eye on the comments too for all your suggestions so drop those below thank you all for being here I'll see y'all soon peace